Hello everybody, welcome to another Rainbow Six Siege video. Uh, today I'm going over the best solo queue operators for quick match, standard, and ranked. This is for coppers only, or whatever. These are the people I play mainly, and I recommend you should use them a lot of the time. Because you don't know when you're ever going to need them. And so on and so on. So without further ado, let's get on with number one. Number one is going to be Doc. This man is so powerful. It's a one-man team. When you're down, you instantly heal back to 125 HP. And you can heal your teammates back to 125 HP as well. When they're down. It's basically like a one-man army. Next up on the list is Rook. This man is also a one-man team. Supplies armor for everybody on the team. It gives him like about 40 or 25 extra health, I'm pretty sure. He has a 2.5 scope on MP5, which is really good. He has an MP90 and the same shotgun as Doc, too. He's a really good operator if you just want to help your team out. Highly recommend playing him. He's pretty good. He's a 1 speed 3 health. Pretty slow. But still, he'll do a dent into the attack team. He is very good, though. Next up, we have Kavira, the most annoying operator in the entire game. She has one of the worst SMGs. It has, like, a fire rate of 500. But there's a really good key factor to Kavira if you want to play her. If you're feeling a little bit, like, risky or whatever. I would use a shotgun and then her pistol. She is a hundred health. She is a three speed. And she can interrogate and give everyone's location off exactly, which is why she's a decent operator. Other than less, yeah, if you want to play her, then go ahead. That's on you. So next up on the list is Solus. We have one of the strongest operators on defending right now, which is Solus. She is pretty good. Uh, she gives a lot of intel. Gets rid of all the drones. Changes entirely how the attackers play in general. And she's pretty good. I'm trying to think of anything else I could add on to this. I'm just saying that she's pretty good. There is one thing I do recommend though. Uh, use the P90. The shotgun doesn't do that far range of damage more of a close range shotgun she has a uh, SMG 11 as her secondary which is good from far distance I recommend using her if you are like on your last resort and are losing she is definitely one of those operators that will help you a lot trust me when I say this she is a A tier operator she is a 2 speed 2 health next up we got the man recruit uh, very simple. If you don't have any operators, just play him. He has an MP5K, SMG11 shotgun, and he's basically just like one of those like noob, basic free operators, and he's really good for attack and defense. Now we get into the attacking operators, which is personally my favorite. So, we will start off with the man, Sam Fisher, aka Zero. One of the only operators to have an MP7 with a 1.5 which is really good. His SC3000K is really good too. And overall, it's basically like Twitch but better because his cameras can zap and destroy utility more intel. He has four of them. He is a three speed, one health, and is a god tier solo man, one man army. Highly recommend buying him for 10k renown. And yeah. Next up, here is my main man, Glass. This is my personal main pendy on the map. Uh, all I gotta say is, a very sneaky, quiet, like, sniper guy. He has a 3 speed, 1 health. He has a DMR, which is deadly. His ability is basically that he can see through smokes. That's really it.
Next up, we have Ace, one of the best hard breachers in the game. I do not care what you say. He has the best gun in the game as well. And he has a 2 speed, 2 health, and he's really good for a solo queue breacher when you really need it. Next up is Buck. He is one of the best soft breachers like soft wall he has a skeleton key which is like a secondary shotgun onto his main gun he has a dmr rifle as well he is pretty good he is one of those solo queue operators you have to have to really end off this video with a bang i'm gonna say ram is a really good solo queue operator she has an r4c with a 1.5 and 2.5 scope which is pretty good not only is she like the loudest operator in the game when she throws her boogies it can like help plant as well like for example your teammates under you as gridlock planting right you throw a boogie and it's pretty loud it will cancel the sound of them planting so they'll have to find you and take you out real quick and that gives gridlock enough time to plant the the fuser and get a successful kill and win Based off that alone, I'm pretty sure she's an amazing A-tier operator. Anyways, that's really it for this video. I had fun making this and playing Siege again after like two weeks of not playing it. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. Like and subscribe if you want. I don't care. And have a good night, folks.